All right, well, let's get back at it. Uh, so what do you think of our situation, Artyom? Not so good, huh? Now, besides, we had guests too. Gave them our best welcome, naturally. Well, the beast ran straight into Stepan with his mint grinder, and he just minced them. We rushed out, but only saw the bodies. One of the bodies, blood, was Stepan's. Now, at first, I thought the bastards got him. Nah, he didn't even have a scratch on him. It was a freaking heat stroke. He's down in the station building now, resting. The rest of the guys are not in a great shape either, so... If those oil bandits decide to put real pressure on us... We are screwed. And no. they may just do that, because I think that guild lady is trying to use us as a piece in her own game, blet. Having us take those bandits out would play right into her hand. Though, if we are all out from dehydration by the time they arrive, that plan will backfire big time. Oh yeah, that's true. The colonel ordered that water is to be only given to the sick, and those on patrol doesn't drink at all himself. <sighs> so he's cooped up inside, and there is no getting him out. He says he's too weak. It might hurt the morale if people see him like that, you know? As if the morale could get any worse with no water at all. <laughs> it got so bad, Yermak decided to try and condense some from the air. It's goddamn desert, blin. So this is the situation. We need water and fuel, badly. And we need a hell of a lot of both. With Aurora turning over two tons of water into steam per hour, her appetite for fuel is also nothing to sneeze at. We're up a shit creek here, and we'd better find a pedal soon, you know? Or else we ain't gonna come out smelling like fucking roses. Well, that's my take on the things, at least. Also, his one frame transition to about face. Huh. Should I go and take out the mission first? Not sure. There's like one or two things over there that we can do right quick. Um, actually, you know what? We'll go get the water first because I have a feeling that on the right side of the map is where we're going to be going for the last mission. So, let's figure it out. Listen up, everyone! The Baron was about to speak! Listen up, everyone! The Baron is speaking! Alright, slaves from the West Canyon are finally at the ship. That would be the last of them. Tristan, you get there! Select the ones good enough to sell to the south and put them on the special training regiment. And this time, make That's sure weird. the boys from the south don't complain we're sending half dead shit. You got me? As you were, everyone, the Baron has spoken. It's a U-turn anyway. No. Uh, uh, F. How are the guys doing with no water? While you were away, I scouted it out a bit. 
I mean, I As did too. As you might suspect, we're approaching the spring through the back door. Kiel says lots of people used to live in these caves. Uh, there was basically a real town. But then the geysers opened up and they all had to flee. Well, let's go! <laughs> well, the bridges are burnt now. Let's climb a bit higher to get a better look around. The cave isn't going anywhere. I oh, know he wanted me to follow him. Okay. Oh, can't slide down this one. It's a rope ladder. Yeah. Nice animation there. The leg. <laughs> wow! That's some noise! A little bit, yeah. What's that, huh? Ah, shaitan! <laughs> Don't like bats? Stupid bats! Yeah, this place is totaled. When setting out, I kind of had hopes of finding something about my people, if not my relatives. But now I find out. And it hurts. Steady, steady. What ethnicity are you, anyway? Aha! Uh -huh. Right at the entrance. Oh, yeah. Get ready, Artyom. Charge the torch, check the filters, and other gear. I have this feeling, a vaguely unnerving one. Well, to hell with the feelings. Here, let me give you a boost. That's how you're supposed to get in for the place. Definitely didn't spend like an hour trying to figure out how to get in here. Come on, draw me here. Let's explore this cave next time on Dash.